Hi, my name is Werner, and I am the uh, film and broadcast director of the church. It's great to be able to talk to you today through this particular verse in uh, 2 Corinthians 1, 21 to 22. And it says this, And it is God who establishes us with you in Christ, and has anointed us, and who has also put his seal on us, and given us his spirit in our hearts as a guarantee. This is, uh, once again, 2 Corinthians 1, 21 to 22. I often think about how I direct myself to God, and I've come down to this one conclusion which has guided my life in my later adulthood, I suppose. I tend to believe that I must assume the presence of God in my life. Assume it whether I feel it or not. That I have to believe by faith that God is in my life and the life of those around me. And that His guidance and His protection, His anointing is always with me no matter what. Even through my own failings, even through my own uh, issues and, and faults and, and fallings, I should say. I know that God is there because He has guaranteed it. The fact that the Spirit is in my heart, or in our hearts, I have concluded that I have to assume it. And when you assume something like this, well, then you're not thinking about yourself all the time, and you're not thinking about whether I fit in, whether I did well, whether God uh, approves me, or whether has accepted me, the, the directions that I'm going is a good or is a bad. Because there's one thing that is obvious in, in terms of following Jesus. I believe in Jesus, I believe in who He is, but I believe more in what He stands for. His love, His compassion, His willingness to look at others even greater than Himself. I mean, it's a huge, a, a huge step uh, of, of difference from what the rest of the world thinks when everybody's thinking, how can they better everybody else? Jesus says, you need to die to self. This is what God has established in us through Christ. This is the lesson that we've learned. And, uh, and my prayer today is that we understand that we are fine, that God has put His seal on us, that He has given us His Spirit as a guarantee, and that He has anointed us, and we are guaranteed for whatever life God has for us. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we just like to thank you, Lord, that we are in you and you are in us, no matter how we feel, no matter the trials and temptations that we face each day. I thank you, Lord, because you have approved us, because you have filled our hearts with your Holy Spirit, Lord, and because you have guaranteed our pathway to you. Be with our families, Lord. Be with our church and we with the world that we touch around us, Lord. We ask all of this in your name. Amen. God bless you, and I hope this has helped you.